Hey guys, welcome to my channel, Hopper Z Channel. Today we are playing Zach's Service Station on Roblox. And right now, um, the store is closed. As you can see on the sign right here, sorry, we're closed. Well, that's not really uh, more of a challenge, no. It's just something. Um, but we are a worker here now. Have no idea how I got employed here. Uh, so we really just restock stuff here and um, check. There will be some cashiers. Usually there's two cashiers here that, you know, check out the um, customers. And looks like we need some, what do you call those? Like, I have no clue what they're called. Wait, they're supposed to be here. Some packable, no, something meals. I don't think it's minced meals. I think it's like a cold meal, if I'm not mistaken. Do, 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 do. Uh, instant meal. Or in this case, instant meals, not instant meal. So we're just gonna put them right here. Nope, right here, yep. And I think only one can fit here, oh well. I'll just um, put them stack on top of each other. And it should look something like that. And we really just take care of the customers, you know. Nothing too crazy, I think. And over here is the manager's office, but we don't have a manager, which is really weird. But, oh my god, there's so many chemicals here. Why are chemicals next to the snacks? Aren't, isn't that supposed to be illegal or something? I have no clue. This also chemicals? I think th these things are blocking it. I, don't, I have no clue what those are either. Bakery. I really think chemicals shouldn't be right next to food stuff. Man, this place loves to have chemicals. Why do they have so many cleaners here? My gosh, now I'm just thinking it's I see them in the reject the most ridiculous place. We can also like do stuff outside, kind of like a janitor. And no, uh, we're not getting mistreated here. That seems to be a common thing amongst that. No windows are dirty today. I guess that's good, right? Well, I don't have to do anything, so I guess that is good. Well, over here we can see that we are we only have tomatoes, so that's bad, right? Real bad. So what we can also get here are, let's say we want some carrots. We're just gonna carry them right to this carrots place, and we can just press R to rotate them. And I am not on mobile, so don't blame me. Oh, never mind. Potatoes just randomly appeared. Or or am I on the wrong place? Yeah, I was on the other one. But you know what? We don't care. And we also need tomatoes for the other one. So we're going to get some tomatoes right here. And put them right over here. We can place a couple of them. Um, you can see over there that it says two pieces, one piece now, on the right of my screen, on the right. Um, and there's, we also need some cucumbers, we don't, we don't have any cucumbers. And the red means that you can place them, as you see right here, and the green means you can place them like that. Am I a good worker here? We could be the manager, as I said, they're, we're, they're needing of a manager right here, they can see. We are looking for a manager, but it costs 25 Robux, I'm pretty sure, so... There's supposed to be drinks in the freezer, gosh. We're gonna need to get some drinks. Let's get some generic soda. Now this game... Most likely, we're gonna be in first person because placing stuff in first person is just a lifesaver. If you want to actually be efficient in placing stuff, I recommend being in first person, like always. Like, never be in 
first person, a uh, sec, a uh, third person. I don't actually know what second person is. I only know like first person, third person, but I have no clue what they call a second person. Um, someone please tell me that. Like, I have no clue on the data of that. Okay, we also need to refill here too. So let's just grab some from right here. You know, you know what? No, we're not gonna do that, bro. So so many stuff already finished gosh that thing goes fast no one likes tomatoes over here apparently no one wants to come here um we're just gonna ploop a ploop ploop and a ploop and this is the self checkout apparently let's see what they do here at the self checkout I think the self checkout is actually faster than the check. Then oh my god, what is this? It says it's a puddle. Why would there be a puddle in the middle of the store? I think it's someone's vomit or something. Gosh. Now since there are no, ma that thing's just gonna take care of that. So there's no need of humans anymore in this world. Robots take over everything. Or does Chat GPT listen to our conversations? It, why is the AC off? The store is still open. The AC should be on. Man, I, I, I really don't give people advice, but one advice that I can. Oh, I think we're. I think we're close. Yeah, we're close. We're close. Sorry, we are closed, or we are closed. Same thing. And we're, why, why does the store want a manager so bad? I don't get it. I don't think any, either person want to get it either. And this is just a, uh, I want, can I self, can I self check out if I work here? I mean like, that's not supposed to happen, but like, is that possible? I mean, you could if you just bought something from the store, but like self check out and put it back on the, you know, like the shelves. I think that would be just so worthless. Like, why would you do that? <laughs> like nobody would ever buy something to put it back on the shelf. Well, are the windows dirty? I need to clean the windows. Am I a janitor? Am I a jan- Yep, I'm a janitor. Do janitors clean windows? I think they do. Do they? I think that, yeah, they probably do. Why am I asking such a question? They always do. I'm not a janitor here, but let's just pretend we're a janitor. I'm a janitor here for a second. And just, there's also a workshop which we're not gonna go through. I'm pretty sure they have their privacy there. Like, really, really privacy stuff. Or maybe they just have a shop there. Yeah, why would they have something secret just for people to go inside and find out? Hmm. Oh, well, well, I guess I'm quitting my job here as a janitor, so that's where I'm going to leave it for today. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe to my YouTube channel and like this video, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys!